is up YouTube world right so I came home and I made myself some food first and ate first but he was all out and about checking me out saying hey bud I'm hungry you gonna feed me some fish <laughs> I really need to clean the glass before I take a video I'm sorry guys it happens every time but he's just chilling right there because he got done waiting for me to eat but I got him some fish prepared so we're going to be all excited and feed him some fish. The anatomy moved up. He used to be way down there, but he's up here now. So, that's interesting. He's on the move. The anatomy. I think the anatomy is a little bit down. I think I want to give the anatomy a new home because I wanted to get some clownfish. But from all research, the true moray eel would most likely eat the clownfish. <laughs> Alright, let's go feed him some fish. So I actually got a whole plate here. <laughs> and yes, we got one head and three fish. Alright. This is how it worked out. They're about to be frosted, so I'm going to go ahead and put them in there. I'm going to actually just put them in there, put them in there so he can go ahead and touch them. Oh, look at him. See, he knows what's up. Just opening up the lid, he knows what's going on. Like, I know, buddy, you're hungry. Let me get the tongue so I can get can, I can get the head in here. Oh oh oh! There we go. Look at that. Wow! You see this, bud? Right here, buddy. Yeah, the boy's hungry. Go ahead and get you some fish. Go ahead and get that head right there, buddy. Yeah. That's all you. Are you still hungry? Look at you, beautiful you. I'm jump out now. I'm gonna put a fish in there. You're gonna have to hunt it. Yeah, and jump out now though. There we go. There we go. It's a French. Oh, it's moving. Oh, do it. It's going over here. He's way over there. Like a dragon. He's like a dragon. He's like a dragon. I'm going to close this lid so you don't decide to do anything. Oh, it's a front of your. There you Bam! Like a dragon. Damn, you ate it already, buddy? You didn't even taste it. You didn't, not, you didn't even taste it. You look like a drag dude, you're you're the coolest animal in the world. <laughs> Much better than the common, you know, what everybody has, the snowflake eel. I mean no disrespect, I like the snowflake eel a lot, but you know everybody has the snowflake eel. Go ahead and get that boy. Oh first try, that's what I'm talking about. You still got one more. Right there, buddy. I'm gonna go ahead and close this again. But yeah, he hungry, so we put what? A head in there and three fish. So he already ate a head and two fish, so he got one more to go. And look at him, he's, he, he's scouting, he still smells it. He's like, there's a fish in here, and I'm gonna get it. Don't move, buddy, it's coming your way. Oh, he sees it. You, you know he sees it. You know you see it. Don't 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 go over towards the anemone, the anemone will fuck you up. <laughs> Damn, look at you, you beautiful boy. And in this case, that was a pretty good video, I think. That's an exciting video right there. Oh, you still hungry? Hey, don't get the blunny. Leave the blunny alone. I'm surprised the blunny is actually still around. But surprisingly, from the research I did, blunnies can actually go with eels. Don't try to eat my finger, buddy. And I, the reason why I think that is because, especially the scooter bunny, he buries himself at night. So he, he can't find them, you know? <laughs> Boy, be hungry. You could eat another fish, couldn't you? But yeah, blunnies. There's a conscience, you know? Con conscience. If I can pronounce that right. You just gotta be careful with the blunnies. Hell yeah. Alright, YouTube. I wish you an awesome night. And y'all be good. Like this.